The first word that would come to my mind is breathtaking. The adventure aspect of BC and, and the wilderness is what really drew me to Prince Rupert. There's trails three or four minutes away from my house, so we're out here two or three nights a week uh, with the dog. Fishing, boating, camping, you know, right at your fingertips. And everything's just bigger in the north. Bigger rivers, bigger lakes, bigger mountains, bigger wildlife. Brittany moved in uh, across the street from me while we were in elementary yeah. school. Yeah. yeah, so we've known each other since then. I was going to school, working three jobs down in Victoria, and then I made my way back to Prince Rupert, intending only to stay for six months, maybe a year. There was employment opportunity for both my husband and I. Living here again and thinking about our life through a different lens, we realized that this was actually the perfect place. So I think we've been back for nine years now. We were able to buy a house and we're gonna start our family here. And it's great to be able to get together and have all the kids play and grow up together just like Monica and I did, I think is gonna be really special. The lifestyle in Prince Rupert is quite slow paced, laid back. But then when you walk into the office, there's so much going on and we have so many different things happening under one roof. Pretty interesting living in a small town on the north coast but being involved in international business. The value of the trade that we're moving through our port is $35 billion. And that's, that's significant to have that impact on the nation and international trade that Little Prince Rupert has is quite remarkable. It's provided a lot of economic opportunity for people, a lot of well-paying jobs. We have about 85 plus staff at the Port Authority, but definitely the port and all the associated terminals provide about 5,000 direct jobs across the region. We have an entire environmental team that works with water sampling and air quality monitoring. We got professional engineers, we got professional accountants, marketers, communications people, marine people, your harbor master. You've got all those specialties all working together under one roof and I find that to be really quite fascinating. Everyone brings a different perspective and I think what comes out of that is better decisions. Seeing how professional and how fast paced it is to work for the Port Authority is what really drew me here. There's endless opportunities for professional development, for courses, for training. We have 10% of our staff enrolled in an executive MBA program right now that the organization is assisting with. We don't want to be seen as just an employer and economic driver of the community. Really, it's the people in the community that drive the port. There is a rich First Nations culture here. We're on Simsian territory, and this was also kind of a trading hub. So it's really deeply ingrained in our roots here in Prince Rupert. There's a lot of activities to do within the community. It's got a great uh, pool facility. Beer league hockey, uh, softball teams. Dance studios, a new gymnastics club. Pretty vibrant sort of arts and culture community here as well. There are really good restaurants and a variety of them, and most of them are locally owned. It has a, uh, a squash club, which is uh, something that's very important to me. What it does mentally and what it did for me physically, I think, it helped cement me in Prince Rupert, making, I, I felt like I belonged and uh, I really enjoyed the community. Everyone's been really great, not only at work, but anyone that we've met in the community. Once they find out we're new, wanting to know how we like it so far, what they can do for us, that aspect has been like insanely welcoming. Immediately people are inviting you over for dinner and you know trying to get you ingrained in the community right away and I think that's really important. For anyone who likes being outside and camping, fishing, hiking, whatever it is, this is a remarkable part of the world. The opportunity for growth here is incredible and it is a very dedicated and hardworking group of people who will do whatever it takes to get the job done. I mean, we're looking for people who are ad adaptable, who have got a high level of resiliency, who are willing to take on new challenges. We anticipate more growth and more jobs and hopefully more people moving up to this part of the world to find work. <laughs>